but frost, ice and snow, the forecast for the next two or three days could affect many travellers, especially on the roads and pavements in the north tonight with quite a widespread frost and also a risk of some snow further south as well. Those are our overnight temperatures, as low as minus five across parts of Scotland, a little bit warmer further south, and it's here we've got a fair amount of rain, and that rain is slowly creeping its way south, the rear edge of some of that rain turning to wet snow, and then even over the higher routes we could see some of that snow fall throughout the northeast of England and parts of Scotland, mainly in the form of wintry showers. But it's in the south here, we keep a lot of cloud. That snow above about 200 metres or so, but even some coming lower down, that's about 600 feet or so, gradually creeping its way southwards. A frosty start elsewhere, but at risk of a few snow showers coming and going. All in all, quite a wintry scene through Christmas Day, and a top temperature of 3 or 4 degrees, but because of the strength of the wind, it'll feel much colder than that. Now then, into Boxing Day, we have this area of low pressure starting to creep up from the south, so it's the southern areas that could be still at risk of some snow to fall, southern parts of Wales and also southern England with snow 200 metres or so, but drifting in those strong northeast winds. Boxing Day's forecast then, a lot of bright weather further north, but in the south we keep a lot of cloud and some outbreaks of snow, and not that warm, just one or two degrees. From all of us here, have a great Christmas. Bye for now.